Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing the Fame Expo haul. I went last weekend and it was so much fun. I had a great time. I really enjoyed it. And yeah, I got some good stuff and yeah. So if you want to see this haul, then please keep watching. Okay, so before I start, I did get a couple stuff. Um, you know, your money goes by so fast and when you're buying all these things like you don't even notice like how much money you're spending and so yeah it was a great though other than that I had a great time but yeah let's get started so the first thing that I'm gonna get to is the I stopped at the um, Makeup Geek booth and I got the Manny MUA palette so I was really excited about that because I've never tried Makeup Geek eyeshadow. So this is what the um, box looks like right here. And yeah. So that's the box and this is the palette. The packaging is really nice. And I'll show you what the inside looks like. So this is what the palette looks like on the inside. The shades are really nice. So yeah, that's what I got at the Makeup Geek booth they didn't have a sale going on everything was just regular price but um, the good thing about that is that you don't have to pay for shipping which is really nice so yeah that's what I got and so the next thing that I got was um, the light and crime Venice palette this is what it looks like so this is the packaging and it's really nice I like the shades in the palette as well they're really gorgeous so that's what the palette looks like And yeah, um, next I'm going to move on to, let's see. So the next booth that I went to was Crown Brushes. And I have never tried Crown Brushes, so this is my first time. And I got an angle brush. This is the C409. So that's what I got. And then the next thing that I got were two palettes. I believe they were like to 425 or something like that but I got the contour the 10 contour um, palette so that's what it looks like that's the box and I'll show you what it looks like on the inside so this is what the inside looks like it was a um, the 26 shade professional contour palette so that's what it looks like. And I'm going to go through this really fast just because I have a lot of things that I want to go through. But um, I'll show you guys everything. Try to get through it as fast and not make this video so long. So this is what the palette looks like. The shades are really nice. I believe these are like blushes. And then all of the other ones are eyeshadows. So... Okay, so the next stop that I made was Be Bella. I believe that's how you say it, Be Bella. And I got a palette, and I got this one, and this one is the Glow Dust palette. And I fell in love with this palette. Like, I was watching it while I was at the booth and checking out, and this called out my name. They are highlights. And they are really um, big size pan and yeah it was such a good deal so I had to get it so the next thing that I got at Be Bella was this fan brush I really needed a fan brush this is the Be Bella fan brush 129 so yeah that's the other thing that I bought there the next booth that I went to was the original beauty box and I got this mirror which is really nice and yeah so that's what the mirror looks like and the light does go on I think hold on let me turn it on okay so yeah that's what I got at um beauty the original beauty box you do get this bag this makeup bag which is really nice and big 
Okay, so the next booth that I went to was Ardell and they were having a sale. I believe it was like a 6 for 20. So I got these Wispies right here. And the next ones that I got were the Double Up. So. Got more Wispies, so that's that. These tapered Lux lashes. Number 805. So these are the 805s, and then I got the 803s, and then I also got some of the Glamour lashes. So the next stop that I went to was Lady Moss, and they were having um, a sale on their Coco lashes, which was 4 for 20, and then I got, let's see, I only got 4, and I got some of the Queen Bee that Katie always talks about and then I also got some of the goddess lashes as well after that I went to Nimi's which they have like all these brands in their booth so I got the flutter lashes flutter lashes and these are the lashes that I got this is crazy and this one is just that I got are these from Fl Flutter Lashes? Flutter Lashes. Okay, so yeah, I got these too. And also from Nimi's, I got the Elsie Foundation that um, Jacqueline Hill always talks about this. So I decided to give it a try and just shade sand. So this is what the packaging looks like. It's so nice. Uh, I can't wait to try this one. The next booth that I went to was Pinky Rose. And I got their um, palette, which is really nice. And, um, it has 35 eyeshadows. And this is what the palette looks like. It has all these shades, and I'm super excited to try it out. Okay, so the next thing that I got was the RCMA powder. I know um, Kathleen Lights raves about this all the time, so I decided to give it a try and buy it. So, yeah. And then the next thing that I went, the next place that I went to was LA Girl. And they were having 4 for 10, but... I only got three. Somehow I lost the other one. But anyhow, so this is the Pro Concealer High Definition. And this is in the shade Porcelain. And then I got the other one in the shade Orange. And then this one is green for correcting. So, so the next booth that I went to was Drama Queen. And I got a liquid lipstick in the shade Ken. So if you guys have never heard of this brand, um, she is Lupio's wife. And so yeah, and I got the shade Ken, which is something that I've never used before. It's kind of like a... I don't know how would you describe it like a raspberry color so I'm really excited to try it out they did have um, a good sale going on but I only got one and I also got this lash applicator in pink so and then I also went to those colors and they were having such a good sale too so I got two of their liquid lipsticks and the ones that I got were Desert Sway and then Quart. So yeah, I'm not going to swatch them. If you want to see videos on these, you probably will see them later or just let me know if you want to know see swatches of the Dose of Colors. I do have a couple, but um, yeah, just because this video would be really long, but okay. So the next stop that I went to was D-E-P. 
so i've never heard of this brand if you guys have heard of this brand let me know down in the comments below if you like this brand if you've tried them before but i believe this is d e p so yeah and i got the shade fearless and i also got the shade go getter and confidence so yeah if you guys heard of this brand let me know if you want to see a review on these they were um on the less pricier side so yeah let me know if you want to see a video review on these or swatches i only grabbed three of them they didn't have that much selections but um i will leave everything down in the description box also Okay, so the next booth that I went to was NYX and I grabbed a couple stuff from there. They did have like a 40% off or something going on, but I didn't grab too much. The booth was just too crazy and crowded and yeah. So I got some lip liners in the shade, I want to say natural. So this is natural and then peekaboo neutral. Um, I already tried this one, which is really nice. And then I also got a concealer. This is the HD concealer in the shade Glow. So, yeah. And then next thing that I got was the Angel Veil Primer, which I've been wanting to try, but I haven't had a chance. So I finally, I was able to get my hands on it, so... And then I also got two of their lingerie. So I also got two of their lingerie liquid lipsticks. And I, the shades that I got were Ruffle Trim and let's see, Lace Detail. So I only got two of them. They were just everywhere on the counter. Like you just, it was really crowded. So I was just like, I'm done. I'm getting out of here and I'm going to get whatever I can. But I, got, I only got two of these, so can't wait to try them. Okay, so the next stop that I went to was Timeless Angeles. And I got this cute phone case that's on my phone. And it has the lipsticks and everything. And it does say Timeless Angeles. So, yeah. And I also got another one, which is this one right here. And I like this one. This is what it looks like. And this one says, you can't blend with us. And it has some brushes on it right there. So yeah. Okay guys, so that completes my Fame Expo haul. I hope that you guys enjoy it. If you wanna see any reviews on this, on any of these makeup brands, then please let me know on the comments down below. Like this video, subscribe if you haven't already so you can stay updated with my page and um, get notified for when I upload new videos and also follow me on Instagram it's isisrobles17 so I'll see you guys all on the next one bye